first testimonial for tonight. Um, is it Isabel, Isabel Marin? Is that how you say it? Yes, you that's how you say it, yes. Welcome to the Come Alive call, Isabel. Uh, where are you calling in from tonight? I live in uh, Southern California, uh, city of Carson, actually, by Long Beach. Ooh, by Long Beach, must be nice. What's your weather over there? Because I'm kind of weird in, in uh, New England right now. About five. Nice. So before we get into your story, what are you passionate about? We like to take an opportunity to get to know our shredders. Passionate. Oh, uh, I travel and a, a workout. Uh, I'm a workout crazy woman. Workout at five o'clock in the morning. <laughs> every Good. day. Every Good day. You. What's your favorite workout? Uh, I do uh, high intensity, um, so I, I don't like running, so that that I hate, but they make us run. <laughs> yeah, my spin class was canceled tonight, and they're like, you can go to CrossFit. I looked at the like, workout of the day, and there's running. I said, no, I'll go home and spin, thanks. Yeah. <laughs> so I hear you on that. I am not a fan of running either. So who shared ER trade with you? So, um, you know, this to me is more like a, uh, I, I'm a, a believer in God and I, and I believe that he puts people together for a purpose. I, I am, uh, currently with the nutritional cleansing. Yeah. And, um, I was doing that for, for a while and I always post up, uh, from the ISA body challenges and stuff, you know, people on my, on my page and I, ran across uh, Sarah and uh, I never knew her, didn't know her. And, but I like to ask for permission to post their pictures. And she goes, oh my gosh, I'm so honored. And she told me about the ER shred and what she does. And I'm like, what is this? Sarah so, O'Bannon? Yeah, yeah. And uh, she didn't know me from Adam. Uh, we didn't know each other, but she gave me this whole spiel and and I said, what is this? And so she is the one that introduced me. And I can say she is my coach. <laughs> um, and uh, she walked me through it literally. Okay. Because uh, I was, this is new, but uh, I, uh, it's a no, but to me is, is a godsend because of the way it happened and how we've connected and it happens to be that her and I are very similar in many, many ways. So we've, we've bonded as, uh, as friends through Facebook, but Messenger and she holds my hand, she, but she no longer has to hold my hand because I got it. <laughs> That's awesome. That's awesome. So what was new and different for you when you were looking at this? Well, what uh, kind of freaked me out was the, the, um, the the meat and, uh you know uh because that's not you know it's not in the plan and uh so i i said okay i'm gonna trust her because she is i found her from a trusted source so uh i i she gave me where to find everything literally treated me like i was a brand new little girl showing me how to so I did exactly what she told me I did exactly but then I told my husband we're doing this and he goes are you for reals and I said yeah we're doing this just trust me trust me and uh we started it and and here we are I I'm, I'm super pumped uh I I've switched I call it I'm tweaking it I'm tweaking it that's what I call it. The other thing to the um, incubation of the shakes, um, they, it, it's truly amazing. It, it, it really is. I have no other words to say than this is uh, a keeper. I told my, my husband, okay, that's it. This is it. We're, this is our plan forever. And he goes, okay, whatever you say, you know, so he follows whatever I tell him to do. He <laughs> 10 pounds, the first shred. Uh, I lost eight plus a lot of inches, um, which Sarah told me you didn't measure it correctly. So 
I've lost more than the four inches that I thought because I only I didn't measure my neck and my so I've lost more. But um, I that I just I could keep talking until forever until you stop me. But I absolutely love it. I, I mean, I'm I'm to the point where um, it says you to uh, you know have the water at a, at a certain temperature scientifically. And I do it exactly like it says on the paper. I don't just say, no, I'm going to do it lukewarm. No, it's 85 degrees and that's what it's going to be. <laughs> and I have my husband watching it to make sure, but that's just me. Everybody can do whatever they want, but I like to do it perfectly well. So you're a rule follower. How has it been being a rule follower? Like I'm hearing that. How has that been for you? I love it. Uh, I mean, I, I, I have structure. So for me, it's the structure. Mm -hmm. So I have the, the plan uh, on my refrigerator yeah. and it tells me, okay, well, like today is my two uh, uh, cleanse days and I'm, I'm doing that as we speak. Cheers. And, yeah, and um, I finished my 11 day uh, shred and I rinse and repeat. I'm going right back at it. Um, I'm not going to stop. I'm not. And um, I told my daughter, she goes, but that looks really hard. And I said, I don't, I, I'm, I'm enjoying the fact that I can have bacon. No kidding. Oh my gosh. I mean, that was like a no, no. As a matter of fact, my husband said, look at all the food that you told me I was going to die if I ate. It. <laughs> and, but it, I said, but it depends what you buy. Because now with this ER shred, I have learned to look at my or read the labels, uh, the bacon, the the meats. They it's specific. It's not like you're gonna go get any bacon. It's specific. No nitrates. You know, it's the junk you're putting into your body. I oh the one thing I hated <laughs> was black coffee. I can't have black coffee. And um, Shannon or Sarah also said, get a frother, get a frother and get the, the butter and start frothing it. Oh my goodness. It tastes like the latte. So honestly, there's nothing bad about this. This is so doable. So I wish my, my daughter would do it. She said she was going to watch it. I said, trust me, do it. But here I am. I can talk until tomorrow. You got to stop me. No, I don't have to stop you because your vibration has obviously come up from what you've been doing. I can see it. I can hear it in your voice. I mean, yeah, I heard eight pounds and more than four inches because there were some mismeasurements, but that's scale stuff. But I can hear it in you that you've decided this is your lifestyle. But what are some of those other non-scale things that you've noticed? So besides the fact that my clothes are are starting to be loose um people are starting to say what are you doing mm -hmm. you know um my gosh you've lost weight and i'm like let me tell you so i you know i this is this is amazing um i i'm happy because the reason i started is because i was at a at a point where i was at a, a plateau and there's so much you can do. And this changed it up. I call it tweaking it because it is a, a, a tweak uh, for the shakes, but everything else is a huge change. And I enjoy it. I won't even have anything but the meat. You know, I'm, and my husband's like, but have some vegetable. I'm, I'm in my 11 day shred. Who's <laughs> finished it? I go, that's. And when I'm going to my only, like when I'm going to a restaurant, people actually are amazed that I'm asking for butter for my coffee. Like, what are you doing? And I said, it's really good. You got to try this. Exactly. <laughs> so I've gotten people that are um, Latinos that do not speak any English. Mm -hmm. And I, I, through you guys. Yep. Spanish stuff all printed that printed out. Shout out to Miss Rocio Rabel for that yeah. one. Yes. And you, uh, Heather, I remember you, you helped me because I had an issue with the shakes and you literally went live and, and did a video to show us what the pro shake is versus the, I mean, that's how, and I have 
truly never seen a, uh, a community so loving, caring, and it truly is a sisterhood and a brotherhood. I, I, this is uh, not only Sarah, but I also met uh, Melanie. She was another uh, mentor of mine. When uh, Sarah, I guess, was very busy, she wouldn't answer me. So I went over to Melanie and uh, I said, hi. And <laughs> she, because I also asked her to, to post her pictures. And that woman taught me how to do the water, the salt water thing. Yes, the pink water, yep. That because I was literally falling asleep and she uh, helped me with, and I did, I learned so much, the pink salt, the minerals, the, the nutrition. I've learned so much in these 11 plus days than in the two or plus years that I've been doing my, my nutritional cleansing. So what I'm hearing from you is the 11 days have been easier for you than the last Two yes. plus years? Yes, uh, because I, I feel, I, I almost feel free, free. Hmm. You know, uh, I can do whatever, I can eat whatever I want, uh, not whatever I want, but the things that I, that I thought were not good for me. Right. You know, I deprived myself and you learn that it's not that it's terrible. It's the choices that read the label. That's all you have to read. Mm-hmm. And, and uh, these two people that I thank from the bottom of my heart is Sarah O'Bannon and Melanie. Oh my gosh, they're, they're my true angels that, uh, and then when I'm down and out that I, I'm like, man, I messed up. I ate too much of the chicken. They're like, you ate well, come on. And so, you know, it, and they just, the, the things that I'm guilty of is eating too much of the meat. <laughs> not, I not. Too, wait, but um, I, I, I truly thank God that I found you guys because I, you guys are di very different, extremely different. We like to be different. But what yeah. I'm hearing from you is, you know, we have this mindset shift that we're eating until we're satiated. Right. which is so different than what we're used to. Exactly. And I'm hearing you say you get to eat, but then some people say, well, you're only eating, but I'm satisfied with what's on our grocery list. I'm satisfied with beef and bacon and shrimp, butter and eggs. Like I am satisfied with that because I'm fully fueling, but I'm fueling with quality versus when I was doing it in the different lifestyle, I'm measuring and weighing and balancing. Can I have this? I, it was a job, right? Yes. yes. And this, while I'm eating like a queen, that's what Lenny tells us. He feasts like a king and a queen. I feast like a queen, but I feast like a queen on quality. And therefore it has become easier. And it's, to me, it's enjoyable because I, Give me a steak every day for dinner and I am satisfied. Yeah, and you know what? It's not a diet. It's not. And and that's what, but you really, in, in my opinion, you have to be committed. You have to really want to be healthy. And 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 because I want to be healthy and because I I love the way I feel, I will continue to do that. And I enjoy shrimp. I I, I do uh, fish, I do the meats. My husband said, well, why are you doing so much meat? And I go, because we haven't had in so long, <laughs> you know, I, and, and it's just uh, satisfying. And then the fact that I can eat, like he said, uh, but you're eating too much. No, I'm, I'm still hungry because I did work out. So I'm going to eat until I'm satisfied, period. I drink my water, nothing yeah. else. It, it truly is simple. It isn't hard at all. If anyone says it is hard. I, I want you to tell me what's the hard part. I, 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 I don't have a hard part. My part is. Um, I, I love that. Um, so my, my question for you after Sarah had, had brought you in, if you were, you're obviously sharing it because your vibration is there and you want to tell everybody what you're doing. I can see it. I can feel it. I can sense it in your energy. My question for you is, what would you say to those that you're bringing in? 
what do you think is the most beneficial thing for them if, if they wanted to give this a try? Well, what Sorry, I, could you say that again? Siri just thought I was talking to her. <laughs> um, um, what I have been telling the people is trust me, trust me, take that one step. Can you do 11 days? Just 11. Mm -hmm. After that, do what you want to do, but give, give yourself 11 days. And, and most of the people that I've spoken to, I have, uh, I have one, uh, her name is Christina. I don't know if, or, um, if she's, uh, listening now, she's following me. I told her, try it. And she's, she's told me, I'm going to keep doing this. I had my son and my, my daughter-in-law and she was very swollen or uh, inflamed or uh, with inflammation. She said, wow, I feel so much better. She goes, of course, I'm going to continue. You know, uh, my husband, he, he's, he's doing the 11 day shred again with me, you know, and he hasn't said, oh, I'm not going to do this. He's doing it. Uh, so if it was hard, you know, and I tell them, just trust me, just trust me. And, and so far, that's what I tell them. Trust me because the people that see me see the energy that I have, you know, and they see how I'm eating and they see that my, my face is cleared up, you know, and, and I'm, I'm happy and, and, and I'm enjoying life and I yeah. love it. And right. I got, I got the, the t-shirt. It's just, I didn't wear it today, but I got the t-shirt because okay. I, I show it off everywhere I go. <laughs> There you go. And you know what? I love that non-scale victory that your, your skin comes back and it glows just from fueling the right way on the inside. You can see it. I, I remember when I was starting my journey, Susan and Jesse used to talk to me about that when we would get into different calls. So anything else on your heart you want to share before I move on to the next shredder? No, I just want to thank you uh, all for the people that have started this, that you started this because <laughs> It truly works. And there's nothing else that is better than this ER shred. And I'm a true believer. I thank you for the opportunity. And uh, uh, back to the studio, Heather. <laughs> well, thank you so much, Isabel. You are a shred warrior. Let's give you some swords because it always takes another level to come on here and share your story and we appreciate that so much. Our